Act 2, The Truth Comes Out, Episode 3, Dawn of the Beacon. Follow me, please. Hmm. There must be a reason why Mijual went out of his way to come to Zed's homeworld. <laughs> Can't imagine he could need anything from this dump. Dump? Are your memories of this world really so terrible? I have nothing but bad memories of this place. The stupid villagers used to pick on me and Biko all the time. What did you say? They picked on sweet little Biko? Every damn one of them shall be sentenced to death! Death, I say! Prism Overlord! As a defender of justice, I can't let you do that! <laughs> it appears we contrast like light and shadow prison. Perhaps you'd like to settle the matter. This is no time to be fooling around! The enemy is upon us! <sighs> Seriously? Whatever, let's just wipe the floor with... Uh. Again? W whatever is the matter, Prince said? Are you in pain? <sighs> it's nothing. I'm fine. Don't give us that, Zed. You're supposed to rely on your friends in times like these. That's right! After all, there are seven of us in the Prism Rangers. How are you doing? Are you still in pain? I'm fine. Being here just brings back bad memories. That's understandable, Zed. But even so, you mustn't disparage your roots. Roots? This is just the place where I woke up a zombie. It doesn't have any sentimental value. Oh? This is news to me! Then where were you born, Prince Zed? Beats me. I don't have any memories from before I woke up. Huh? Then you and Biko... Yeah, we're not blood-related. Neither of us remember our parents. We were just two orphan zombies without money, power, or anything else. That's why those stupid villagers bullied us whenever they got the chance. The only place with happy memories was that little shack we built to protect us from the elements. We were just helping each other out zombie to zombie, but somewhere along the way, Biko started calling me Bubby, and before we knew it, we were family. Oh. I don't give a damn about blood. Biko's my little sister, no matter what anyone else says. I see. So the two of you supported one another. Both truly shared a difficult life. <laughs> Why are you crying? I just... I just... I can't help myself! Seriously, how did you become an overlord?
to go. Bobby! Biko! Oh, caught up already, have you? Not bad. You have exceeded all of my expectations. Shut up, Cerberus! Let her go, right now! Come now, where are your manners? Just think of this as a family reunion of sorts. Go to hell, you stupid mutt! <laughs> that mouth of yours is as foul as ever, I see. Shut it! I'll rip your tongue right out of your mouth! See if you can talk then! Bubby! Sir, me, stop it! Families are supposed to get along! That's what your beloved little sister says. But what say you, Zed? What Biko says goes. I'll get along with you just fine. After I kill you! A wonderful answer, truly. But unfortunately for you, I can't afford to die just yet. I'm detecting a high energy reading. A god of destruction is appearing! have you prepared for us, Super Sage Mijual? It's as if he found them on sale! Buy one, get a dozen free! Stop this madness, Mijual! Release Biko at once! I'm the one you want! I'm the one you truly despise! Despise? You? Oh, <laughs> that couldn't be further from the truth. What? Uh, then... What is your objective? My objective? Why, it's the destruction of the entire universe, of course. You want to destroy the whole universe? But that includes you, too! Oh, I'm well aware. To be destroyed along with the universe exactly what I want. He's purposely pursuing a tragic ending for himself. The hell's wrong with you, Cerberus? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with me. It's the universe that's wrong. the matter, Zed? Go ahead and show me your true strength. <laughs> you really do have a death wish, huh? Fine. Then I'll give you what you want. Stop it, Prince Zed! If you push yourself any further, you'll... Don't try to stop me. That stupid mutt has to pay. 
Cerberus betrayed me and Biko. Even though we thought of him as family. What's the matter, Zed? Why do you hesitate? Very well. It's about time I put an end to this. to save you. I'm making Bubby sad again. <laughs> I keep messing up. I keep hurting Bubby. I just want to help him. But I can't do anything. Sounds so sad. She's crying. Poor Biko. I'm coming, Biko. Don't worry. I'll wipe those. Back off! I'm coming, Biko. I'll wipe those tears from your face. I'm not so sure it'll be that easy. Oh, it's Hero Yarmada! Don't worry, everyone! Our savior has arrived! My apologies, Your Majesty. That isn't why I'm here. <laughs> Do you really believe someone like him is capable of saving anyone? This scum fled from his responsibilities as a hero, lived off the king's fortune, and even tried to steal it for himself. While that may all be true, your Mara is not scum! I fully believe he'll be a hero again someday just as surely as a phoenix rises from its ashes. Your Majesty. Come now, there's no way someone who has fallen so low could ever climb back up again. I'll make better use of him. Better use? What are you going to do to me? Can this be? Hero Yarmada has become a, a Yarmada of destruction! Now there are two of them. It appears we're done for. <laughs> 